Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video and finally we have a great news for now we have an Samsung One UI ported for OnePlus 6. One of my friend who is a developer named as Jay he's ported this UI and now it can be run on OnePlus 6 but as of now it has lots of bugs it cannot be used as daily driver as of now I won't be sharing any download links for this ROM because it is totally unstable and it is only for the purpose of testing. Soon we'll have a public release from developer and once it is available I'll update you guys on that. So as you can see I've already installed it on my device. First of all let me show you the software information. Let's go to settings, about section. Here you can see device is S9 because this ROM is imported from S9. Under software version you can see One UI version is 1.0, Android version is Android 9 that is Pi. Security patches 1st Jan 2019. Most of the things are broken on this ROM, we'll just take a quick look on how does it look on our OnePlus 6. This is your notification panel, swiping it more down you'll have all the quick tiles available and which are very easily accessible with single hand. And on the top you get date and time. Swiping towards right hand side we have Bixby Home available. This is your app drawer where you can see the background gets blurred and it looks really amazing. As I said there are lots of bugs you cannot make calls I already have a sim card here but there is no network available for that sim card. Camera application don't work let's go to home screen settings and here you have the home screen layout you can change the home screen grid you can also change the app screen grid and few other stuffs. You can also hide the applications if you want to. So now let's directly dive inside the settings. So this is your setting panels where you have the waving area at the bottom and then you have settings written over there. Now search option is very easily accessible with one hand. Then you have connections wherein Wi-Fi is working but I don't know some issues with the network indicator. After that we have sounds, sound does not work at all, notification going under display and one of my favorite feature over here is the night mode. If you turn it on you will have a complete dark theme available on your device. We also get edge panel option so here you can see you just need to swipe from the right towards the left hand side. Under navigation bar we have full screen gestures which can be enabled and are working fine. If you swipe from right or left it will take you to the previous menu. If you swipe it from the middle then it will take you to the home screen. After that we have features like video enhancer, always on display. Under advanced feature we have options like smart pop up view, smart capture, direct share reduce animation and few motion and gestures. Under security we have intelligence scan, face recognition, iris, fingerprint and none of them are working. Iris scan won't work due to lack of hardware support and here fingerprint is also not working. So do make sure to support the developer. I'll put up his link in the description below you can follow his telegram group. I'm a huge fan of Samsung devices and One UI is one of the awesome software implementation what they have done with their devices and it now supports almost all the high-end devices like S9, S9 Plus, Note 9, Note 9 Plus. Providing much smoother experience you can use your device with single hand no issues. You don't have to worry about the larger screens what are available on devices. And on that they have additionally added one hand mode. So that can be triggered by swiping from here and here you can see you get a small screen and by which you can just access your complete device with single hand. If you want you can also increase the size of this screen. This is a recent panel where you can tap here and have options like split screen, open in pop-up window, lock the application. So let's open up in pop-up window and here you can see now you can access multiple windows at a single time. So guys this was a quick look on Samsung's One UI. I would again like to thanks Jay for porting this and he's continuously working to fix the bugs what are available on this test build. As soon as he fix the major bugs he'll surely roll out a public release and you guys can test it on your device. But make sure to support him. His telegram group link is given in the description below. So guys this was all about Samsung's One UI for OnePlus 6. Next video will be coming whenever I have a build and in which most of the major bugs gets fixed that time we'll do a complete review on performance and the battery life. And if you have any kind of questions, you can let me know in the comment section below. As of now, only this much in this video. Hope you like the video. And if you like the video, then do give me a thumbs up. Also, if you are new to my channel, then do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.